See, I know that Teresa loves you too much to risk losing you. There has got to be another story. I hope there is. But you shouldn't give up on fancy either because I wasn't there to see what happened, but I know she has a good heart. I need to let her explain. Well, I will. Besides, I love her too much to lose her anyway. Sheridan, Marty's gonna sleep to the rest of the night, right? Yes. Good. I'm gonna go see if I can find Fancy and figure out what happened tonight. It's a good idea. Yeah. Look, if I can somehow manage to work things out with Fancy, certainly you can work them out with Teresa. Now is not the time to give up on the women we love. We're the men that we love. We have to do whatever it takes to hold on to them. Whatever it takes. And then so. What are you doing? I'm praying that my mother stays home. She always taught us that our prayers are answered somehow. <laughs> may be right. Mine are being answered right now. I have you, and soon I will have your mother. Oh! Right on cue. Good evening, Pilar. Oh, yes, yes, Teresa is just fine. Mm -hmm. As soon as you get here, I will release her in exchange for you. It's too late. I hung up before you said anything. She didn't hear your warning. Pilar is in town, Teresa. And she'll be here soon, just as I planned. With two house guests. I can't wait for you to see the hospitality for which I've become famous. No!